guys, so here I am, the mecca of bodybuilding, Gold Gym in Venice, California. To share with you a few peaking exercises to help bring out maximum muscle conditioning and separation from head to toe. Follow me inside and let's have a look at each individual exercise and break it down for you. Now when it comes to conditioning the chest, I'm always trying to focus on maximum striations around the inner portion and the upper thickness. So regardless whether I'm trying to get bigger or stay leaner, I always start on the heavier compound movements first. And the incline bench press is one of the best exercises to really help focus on the upper chest. Now the technique that I want to share with you today is a superset. Now I normally do this at the end of the first exercise, the last set. For example, incline heavy bench as much as I can manage for those 10 or 12 reps and then superset that with a flat bench just to continue repping them out. So, let's get with it. As you can see, it's not all about reaching maximum failure. At this level of the training stage, I don't have the energy or the ability to recover to be able to max out and go super heavy. This is really for those final eight or four weeks out from getting ready for a photo shoot or a competition, and your focus is maximum muscle enhancement. So this technique is a great one, especially for free weights to move from the main work set, ending on a drop set or super set, for that next exercise. Okay, let's move on to the next chest exercise. The next exercise is focusing on a machine. And the reason I start to move on to machines after doing the first exercise the work set on a free weight is I have a much better controlled range of motion. Therefore, I can really emphasize muscular contraction on every rep, forcing that contraction at the peak, getting maximal amount of blood into that muscle. Again, the focus on weight isn't quite the same as when you're building muscle during off-season or when you're not getting super lean. So don't try and go too heavy. Focus more on the quality of the repetitions and the breathing as well. Really exhale on every concentric movement, forcing that muscle as hard as you can on each rep. Again, 12 if not 15 reps with machines. helps with that final rep or two to hold that contraction a little bit longer like an isometric movement and really force that blood and keep it there in the muscle. Okay moving on and let's focus on a cable exercise to help bring out the conditioning in that inner chest area.